Okay, there's two more things I want to show you. The first is a feature of the Everrun, which is the auto rotate feature. So if I put that on its end, you will see the map. I hope you can see that. That's actually reconfigured itself for vertical mode, which is quite useful. It gives you a different kind of perspective on a on navigation because it's a um, map orientates itself to the direction of travel you can see further ahead so you actually see junctions earlier so it's not a bad option to be able to rotate that and uh, we can rotate that back to normal if we want now the second thing I wanted to show you let's just get that in the middle is um, integration with Roadrunner so um, want to hello menu exit from that and then start up Roadrunner. Now Roadrunner is a skinning package that allows you to uh, have finger based control for things like Winamp, um, navigation, there's some communication options and uh, various other things as well. Um, so from the front end you can go to um, music and videos, so for example music and then I can play my music. That uses Winamp in the back end. What we can also do is integrate the navigation as well. So what that uh, does is it skins PC Navigator, puts it inside Roadrunner. So now We've got uh, road running be running behind, and there you go. You can see that it's put it inside a frame now. So in fact, I can go out, go to my music, change my music, and go back to navigation within the same program. Uh, the only thing I don't like about this is that it does take up a rather large amount of screen space. Now, to be honest, if you're, let's just turn that down, if you've got a route set up and you're just following a route, that's probably good enough, because when you think about a pocket PC or a smartphone with a three inch screen, that's about as big as it is anyway. So it's really not bad. The other thing that works over the top is the gestures. So I can... I actually, sorry, I have to do it over here. Otherwise it registers on the screen. Next track, I've only got one track loaded. So that's quite a nice feature. So we come out of there, got the map on. Music off, music on. The only thing is you've got to be careful if you do the similar gesture on the nav PC Navigator. So if you do that to try and move the map, it could register it as a yeah. There you go. It could register it as a music off gesture. So you have to be a bit careful with that. When you play with it, maybe gestures uh, are better switched off in this. But of course, Roadrunner gives you other things like. Uh, weather information and there's a hell of a lot of uh, other options that you can you can do. You can skin phone applications, you can skin Explorer, there's the weather. Um, let's go back to the main menu. There is a simple browser option which skins Explorer. So go to web browser. And that should fire up Firefox and, and put the skin around it. At the moment you can see through to the applications that were in the background. So it's starting up Firefox. Hopefully it's going to skin that. Uh, didn't skin it. Hmm. It has been working for me, but I've been messing around with this a lot, so I might need to change that configuration to get that working properly. So that's quite a nice, uh, nice way to use PC Navigator, skinned inside Roadrunner. 
Okay, I'm going to take this out in the car uh, a bit later on when it's darker and uh, give you a quick demo in the car. <laughs> 